Hey y'all, Papa Explorer here. I am just getting. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. That's getting done with my last. I got done with my last order, and it is up here in the boonies. And I just this this road is sketchy. It's bouncy. It ain't well maintained. It ain't wide enough for two cars to go up. So this is going to be. A little short video of me just getting back down from this place. I just got through delivering my last order. Alright, so here we go. Hopefully y'all don't get sick with the bouncing. Alright y'all, I'm trying to get this thing. Looks like y'all can see the road. Alright. And if y'all hear like the maps going off, I have that going on because it is about 10 o'clock at night trying to traverse this blasted road. And of course, I'm in Bumblebee. Oh, yeah. Look, there's a sign up there. You know what it says? Please slow down. I don't know who the crap's gonna be flying through this blast of road. This is a bunch of bull malarkey. But this was a good twelve and a half. Almost thir very close to 13 hour day. Cause I got here at nine this morning. And it's when I actually stopped. It was just a little bit before 10. So it was right at like a nine hour. No, excuse me, not nine hour. 13 hour day. And this, these last ones. They throw on you, you only got like... In 600 feet, turn right. Yep, 600 feet, turn right. I don't know what I'm turning into. A grumpier old man. This kind of crud old... Take the next right onto Winkler's Creek Road. See, I can't. Oh. Whew. All right, I'm going to film a little bit. That was the crap I had to go up. So coming back down, but going up seriously sucked. Because at least I had Continue a... on Winkler's Creek Road for two miles. So. Door dashing ain't all what the hoops and rainbows or hearts and rainbow stars or I don't know but it ain't all that all the time I mean I enjoy it because it gives me a chance you know to learn a new area because this is Boone but this ain't where we live at we live in Butler Tennessee this is about eh, let's see if it didn't stop for gas it'd probably be like 45 minute drive but see for me 45 minute drive to work is like anywhere so but I do get to see things you know possible locations to go to um, different cars I've seen and it looks like somebody's got uh, just sitting got weeds going up a PG Cruiser now it's got aftermarket chrome rims but I ain't never seen a PG Cruiser with dual exhaust. Never. So, I got marked that thing on the map. I'm gonna write a note and put it like in a little plastic, you know, them little plastic deals you put in a notebook or whatever. I'm gonna put it on the windshield of that thing. But like, 
or you want to sell this, and leave them like contact number or something. Uh, but yeah, it was a nice day today. It was all uh, oh, excuse me, very nice sunny. Probably around in the high 60s, maybe 70. It was very nice today. I'm going to IHOP right now. Give me some pancakes. Uh, take them to the homestead and slap them in the fridge for tomorrow morning. So I get up, I have me some pancakes. And y'all can just ride with me to get the pancakes. Or, you know, to at least go there. This is the same IHOP I took the picture of. If y'all follow me on Instagram. Twitter, if y'all follow me on there, this is the same picture I took where they get the skeleton standing behind a little desk there. And I uh, got it decked out pretty good for Halloween, so. Uh, I might try to stop on the way I get closer to the house, there's a town called Mountain City. That there is a house that across from a um, like a quarry type kind of deal, cement plant, whatever you want to call it. I, I would just say it's a quarry where the trucks go and pick up gravel and all that. Mess. There's a house across from it, it looks abandoned. But uh, when I was looking on Google Maps, I found a road a little bit up from that. Looks like there's possibly a old house now. Google Maps, let's say, probably hadn't updated this area here probably about a year or more. Because I looked it up something yesterday while I was hunting some apartments, and the apartments weren't even built yet on Google Maps, and they're all built up. So I don't know. But I'm gonna stop by. See about stopping by and just see if I find the place. It looked like there was something abandoned back there off this road. I'm pretty sure I marked it on the maps. What is this? Excuse me. One thing y'all can do when y'all are traveling, if you want to do some uh, YouTubing or just exploring for yourself, or whatever. You see a place, but you ain't got really time to do it then. Get the map, you know, stop there, get the maps out on your phone, and mark that spot in like a place you want to visit or something like that. And, you know, it'll ask you if you want to title it or something like that. Shoot. In 800 feet, turn left to stay on Winkler's Creek Road. Okay. So, uh, you know, title that thing. Like, I titled the thing for that PT Cruiser. I put PT Cruiser dual exhaust. Turn left to stay on Winkler's Creek Road. Um, there looked like there was a. If it wasn't an abandoned house, they got it set up perfect for nobody seeing that thing, really, because it's got like trees planted all around it, and there's some ivy. In a quarter mile, turn left onto Blowing Rock Road. Um, there's some ivy growing up on some of it. I can barely see it through the trees. I put on the thing, possible abandoned house. So, that's what I do. And I have learned around here pretty decent. If I would have gone straight, I wouldn't have come out at a red light. Up there on the road is wanting to turn, so I make little detours so I can get out of red lights. Because this town, even though it's this night at night, it might still be a little busy for a Sunday night. So, yeah. Oh, that was great. Yeah, that was on the car. Don't worry. That's, 
That's where somebody had one of them sticker suck pad things or something. That's where they had it before I got the car. Oh, In 800 feet, turn right onto North Carolina 105 North. Yep, that's what we're doing. Swing by. I hop, it goes at 11. It's about 10 after. Take the next right onto North Carolina 105 North. In 1,000 feet, use the left two lanes to turn left onto Blowing Rock Road. I uh, surely will. And I'm going to use the leftest of the left two lanes. Because after I get on this Blowing Rock Road, I have to Use the left two left. lanes to turn left onto Blowing Rock Road. Don't you love how... Who did I call this? I was telling, be creative, or maybe our granddaughter, or something, I named this, this voice that's on the Google, because she asked if it was Siri or Alexa, I said no, I think I said as, as glad as a Google, so, Gladys, Gladys here at Google, she makes sure, I ain't got no blast of sense. Alright. So we almost at IHOP, which means we almost at the end of this particular deal. In a quarter mile, your destination will be on the left. But, uh, if y'all live near Boone, uh, King Street is like the old historic, you know, got all the shops on both sides of the street and all. Come on a Sunday to do that because I found out today that on Sunday all parking down there is free because that whole strip is nothing but parking meters during the week and I guess on Saturday. But Sunday, your destination is on the left. Parking is free down there, so. I'm just going to lean over here. Thank you for uh, riding with me down that hill. Give me somebody to talk to. But I'm going to see about giving me some pancakes. Y'all have a good night. And uh, I'll post this thing up when I get back to the house. I'll post this. It's short, so it won't take long to watch. <sighs> Thank you for watching. Be careful. And uh, stay safe out there, y'all. But if you do something funny, like one of those, uh, what was it? Fail Army type kind of like deals, and you get it on video, or try to get it on video, get it on video. Post that thing up so everybody got something to laugh about, alright? But just, uh, don't get hurt, alright? Y'all have a good night. This is Pepe Explorer, and I'm out.